What's up everybody? I see you like my question and answer video. Let me know if you want me to do it again. So anyways, welcome back to my laboratory. Safety is number one priority. Fire extinguisher. Close by, just in case. Adult supervision, because you never know what's gonna happen. Today we're gonna need two aluminum cans. Wooden stick or pencil or whatever A pair of alligator wires Duct tape, because duct tape fix everything At least that's what they say Aluminum foil And a TV And today we're gonna do some electromagnetic experiment Alright, first thing we're gonna do, tape the aluminum foil First, put it up and tape it then we're gonna put alum two aluminum cans on top of a TV sponsor, not really. Then take off a can opener, whatever it's called, and put it on a stain. Get your stick or a pencil, as long as it's not metal, and put it like that, and put it on top of a cans. Then we're gonna need our wires. We're gonna plug one wire up here, and the other wire up on a can like that. Then you want to get the other alligator's wires and hook it up to the other one, like that. Then get your stick and place it like that, in between of uh, cans. So it's kind of dangling right there, in between. And then we're gonna plug the TV in and turn it on. So I'm gonna turn the TV on. What's going on? You see it's magneting to the piece but I'm holding this while what if I let it go still magneting into it let's turn it off look I'm gonna hold to this side what will happen if I'll turn it off you see how it's dangling What if I let it go? You see how it's still dangling? What if I let it go of this fire? It's gonna stop. So there was that work like ground. As soon as I touched again and start bouncing again. I let go of it. It's gonna stop. It's gonna stop it. Touch it again. Bouncing again. So let me know in comments below, what do you guys think, what do you... How does that work, electromagnetic field? So what do you guys think, it's pretty cool, huh? Do not touch this field, because it will shock you. Do not touch this field, you only ground the can, which doesn't touch the wires with this part. So, what I want you to do is comment below and tell me how does that work, electromagnetic field, you know. Why do I have to touch it? So it would be bounce and I would let it go, it would stop bouncing. Let me know in comments below. Thank you for subscribing and I'll see you next time.